Hello, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing. This unboxing is from DIY Choose. They did send me these items for review, so thank you to DIY Choose. So, okay, that stayed at the bottom, so that gets to go first. So this one is a round diamond painting. It's $4.89. It should be a 30 by 40 canvas size here, so... Ordinary toolkit. It looks like the drills are in these little 200 packet um, containers. So if you've never gotten drills like this, each of these um, packs should be about 200 drills. And they should have the DMC on the front here. So this is 702. So this one is this here. It's these cardinals on a branch. I don't, for whatever reason, I seem to really like the <laughs> the, the bird pictures. I have I have a lot of bird pictures, <laughs> and then I do the bird pictures. So some cardinals on a. Uh, tree branch some snow here there is 20 colors it looks like all the symbols are letters and a drill field looks pretty clear here so i'm going to because the bags don't have any any code on them. I'm going to write the, the part number on them. So QQ211. Now, if you're not like me and have like tons and tons and tons of diamond paintings, I do recommend that you do inventory on the drills, as in just make sure you have all the colors um, here because these are probably packed by people. You know, when they're packed by people, there might be some mistakes, um, but yeah, I have tons and tons of drills. I don't even if if I run out of something, I'm not even I'm not even phased anymore. <laughs> I have I have so many spare drills, so so yeah, it kind of looks like it'll turn out. I'm just I'm sur I'm yeah. It looks it looks at least on on the canvas looks like it might turn out. There is only twenty colors, so I, I do get concerned when there's only twenty colors, but. I think it might turn out. Uh, it is, did I say it was 489? So this is about uh, nine and three fourths inches or about 25 by 35 or a little bit less than 14 inches. So yeah, I think, huh, might turn out. All right, next one. Oh, that's the one that wanted to go first. So, these are supposed to be gloves here. I saw it, I was like, I don't know. I've never had a diamond painting gloves. So this one is $7.49. Um, I don't know if the gloves are going to fit. But we will see, I guess. Okay, so the gloves itself is separate. Like, see, look, you could just buy these gloves. And I don't know what this is for. to give me instructions. So, some gloves, you put the number one, put the drills, blah, blah, blah. So, so, put cardboard under glove to make flat place finish pattern where you want. Put paper over design to prevent a diamond from burning. Turn on iron. Ooh, we're gonna have to iron this stuff. Finally, stick the special diamonds. <laughs> Ooh, wait. So am I supposed to diamond paint it first or iron it on first? It sounds like they don't want me to put the eyes. Okay, it's it's really thin. Whatever this is, this is really thin material.
Seems like you they want you to diamond paint it first, then iron it on, and then put the eyes. See, I'm gonna, so it does come with an ordinary toolkit, except it has a couple baggies, and it comes with the two cats. So these are gonna be two cats here. It comes with some wax paper um, that you're supposed to iron onto it. So let's hope, let's hope I don't burn anything. <laughs> it does look like it has special drills here. Just have to remember, it's it's pretty much saying don't put the eyes on or don't put the special drills on yet. I kind of think I should iron it on first. So one, two, three, four. So the five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so so these are all just regular rhinestones or black drills, and then there are some special drills here. And let's look at the gloves. It does make it seem like they want you to diamond paint the regular drills because they, they save the diamonds from burning. Paint the do the regular drills and then put it seems like the eyes will not survive the googly eyes. Oh, I didn't show it because I'm like distracted by this weird thing. So here's the special drills, and it does include some googly eyes. Um, but yeah, I can see the googly eyes not surviving being ironed. I'm on the maybe it should be ironed before I diamond paint it. So let's see the gloves. I'm just more curious if the gloves are gonna fit me. So so some. Gloves here, it feels soft. There's the inside. There it does say, what does this say? Maybe this other one. B... Maybe it's just beautiful. I, I don't know. I don't think so, though. There's this extra thing. Okay. Question is, will it fit my hand? I have small hands, so if it fits me, I don't think that's a good indication that it'll fit everyone. Um, it fits my hands. It's pretty warm. Put some cat stickers on it apparently and then so you're supposed to put the cat stickers on it or iron on they're gonna iron on this so yeah that's this is gonna be it's gonna be I could see why they said to put the the cardboard in there and then iron it on I'm still thinking you should iron it on before putting the drills on But it does say to stick the diamonds except special diamonds. So I feel like they've they've tried it out already, so it should work, right? Should it work? All right. So I'm going for once you put these on, there's no there's no washing these <laughs> once you put the diamonds on. There's no washing these, so I guess we will see. All right, and did I say this is $7.49? And each of the cats are about seven centimeters by eight and a half centimeters. So this is just showing, yep, you could diamond paint anything nowadays. 
Time to paint some gloves. Although this one seems like it's more iron on. Yeah. Yep. I'm pondering whether I should try ironing it on camera or do it off camera. Because <laughs> I'm like, what if I destroy it when ironing it? So I, I might want to do it on camera just because what if I melt well, melt it and then you'll be I can't I'll be like I can't show it to you because I melted it <laughs> I, I, which I can totally see sorry I melted the cats <laughs> all right next thing here is some bird stickers so these are two dollars and seventy nine cents I see the opening. Why can't I open it? There. So, ordinary toolkit. Looks like these might be regular drills. And here they are. Some owl stickers here. Might be Valentine's Day, -y, Day -y, maybe. No, maybe that's the only one that's Valentine's Day. I guess this is an angry um, owl. <laughs> Here's one for Christmas. A juggling owl, a reading owl, a mommy or a parent owl with a little kid owl, birthday owl maybe. So let's let's measure the angry owl. So the angry owl is about seven centimeters by six centimeters, or a little bit like two and a half inches by a little bit more than two inches. And all the symbols are numbers and looks like they're regular drills so some black yellow brown pink grays and some red and there's lots of white Next thing, so these should be keychains. Okay, so these, okay, so it seems like so there's two toolkits, it actually has a straightener tool in there that's so that's a little bit different and then it has the keychain stuff in there the straightener um accessory and these are the little care bears i don't know any of the names of the care bears if there are there names for the care bears i figured this would be shamrock bear i don't know <laughs> lucky care bear um this one looks like it's blue with a flower here's a pink one with a heart or a lock. Blue one with a moon. A rainbow pink one. A purple one with, I don't know what's in the stomach there. An orange one with a heart. A blue one sticking out its tongue. All the symbols look like they're letters. Or no, wait, there's a symbol. There's symbols here. So a yellow one with maybe a sun. Or did I show this one? The pink one. Here. So there should be 10 of them. Yep, 10. 10 Care Bear. Keychains. And these are $8.89. And let's measure this pink one. I think the pink one's the biggest one. So it's about six centimeters by seven centimeters or about two and one fourth inches by two and a half inches. Okay, there's actually, a, I think, a good amount of colors. So some green, white, blues, yellows, some pinks and purples and reds. 
So yeah, and all the symbols are just kind of written on there. So there, there's the little symbol of that one. There's a line. Yeah. I, I wish they were just all numbers. I'm not a big fan of these specials with the, the letters, mainly because I do these specials. Um, I put them on my tray holder thing and I just have all my tray holder numbered like one, two, three, and it's easier to, for me to do it instead of having these symbols, but it will work still. Did I say those were $8.89? If I didn't, I just said it. So last diamond painting, this one is $4.69. I actually kind of meant for this to be a Valentine's Day picture, uh, but I don't think, I don't know if this video will be up before Valentine's Day, so. So this is $4.69 and it's a 30 by 40, so ordinary toolkit. Looks like the drills are in the baggies. It does look like maybe they already put in the part number right there, which I like. I'm only guessing maybe. It's a really nice color scheme though. I like it. And here it is. Does it say B5710? Yep, here it is. It's these birds on a branch. And I, I've already done um, a bir bird on a branch picture already in a previous unboxing. So this will just be another bird on a branch picture that I could add to my collection to do in the future. Here, and it does say love here and it um, I do recommend if there's any words in your diamond painting to diamond paint all the letters in one single color just because that will help it like pop. Um, instead, like I do see most of them are this R, but maybe perhaps that N here can also be diamond painted the same way. But I just, that's what I just noticed. It's like, if the writing doesn't show up well, don't diamond paint what it's charted, but just diamond paint one single color. And it usually does help it be more readable. So it looks like there's 22 colors. All the symbols are letters. And drill field. Of course, the I and the J are right next to each other. And the T. I, J, and T. Um, but <laughs> I think it looks readable. This one looks like it'll be pretty easy. It's a simple enough image here. And here's the color schemes here. And this is 25 by 35. All right, that's the last one I'm unboxing for this video. So let me move this to the side here. Put this here. So there, the birds. Apparently, I felt like birds on this one. <laughs> and let me move you up a little. So add some birds. Here's some Care Bears. Yeah, the bears, the bears mess up my bird theme here. And because I do have owl stickers. And I guess it's, a, it's an animal theme. Birds and then my cat gloves here. All right, so... Um, I probably will work on at least the cat gloves. I think I'm going to work on all the partials here um, because I'm kind of curious if I'm going to melt the cat glove, <laughs> the cats on the gloves. But I'm assuming someone tried it. That's why there's instructions. <laughs> but yeah, that's all I have for now. So I'll see you later. All right, I'm back and the owl stickers are done. I did seal these um, and... I had to use a liquid sealer because it's too cold for me to use my spray sealer. But I think what I'm going to do now is I, I just realized I just really don't like sealing diamond painting. So I'm just going to hold off on sealing anything unless I actually absolutely, absolutely have to and hold off until it gets warmer and I can still and I can spray seal in my garage. <laughs> so 
this one I took off the back, the backing, so it just looks prettier. So yeah, here is the owls here. They're really cute. And I think this is supposed to be on, um, this video is supposed to be posted on Valentine's Day. So here's, here's a little Valentine's Day um, owls here. And some more owls here. Is this like an owl juggling things, I think? Christmas owl. And did I write anything? So this thing had nine colors. They were all regular round drills. I thought the rendering was fine. All the symbols were numbers, but there were guide circles. It was everything. I didn't have any issues. It just took me 56 minutes to complete. All right. Next up, Care Bear, Care Bear keychains. Here. So the Care Bear keychains, this, there's 10, yeah, 10. Um, there were 13 colors. These were all crystal rhinestones. The rendering was fine. The symbols were numbers and letters. There was a lot of excess stick. So, um, yeah, and it took me two hours and 11 minutes to complete. So this one, I did attempt to seal it, and yeah. Let's just say, like I said, <laughs> I'm not going to start sealing my stuff until later. I don't know if you can tell, but I, I, I'm a failure at sealing. Um, there's like, the, the, the sealant is not clear here. It just bubbled up too much. <sighs> um... And I think I lost a couple drills because it pooled. Yeah. Either way, I am not going to seal anything anymore until it gets warm enough to spray seal because uh, me and the liquid sealers don't seem to get along. Oh, I'm missing one right here. Uh, <laughs> so only one side of these are actually sealed. But here, here is maybe my Valentine's Day Care Bear. I don't know. Is this supposed to be a U? I'm not sure what kind of Care Bear this is here. Here's my um, Shamrock one. You know, I was I was looking through. I was like, you know, I forgot to buy a um, a St. Patrick's Day diamond painting, and it's way too late. Even if I get one now, it's just it's just way too late. <laughs> so, nope. Oh, there's my St. Patrick's Day. Here is. Care Bear with a locket. Rainbow here. Oh, here's one with a heart. But yeah, have to get my diamond painting way more in advance <laughs> if I'm going to do holiday ones. I got my Easter ones done. I got some Easter ones though. All right, so there's that one. And I finished the gloves. Okay, so before I show it, let me tell you. So this thing had 12 colors. One was a regular round drill, six were crystal rhinestones, and five specials. Um, I thought the rendering was okay. All the symbols were numbers. These were gloves. Um, and this took me 23 minutes to drill. Now, <laughs> I melted some of the drills when I tried to iron it on. Yeah. Yep, so that's my disclaimer. <laughs> Before I show you. <clears throat> so, okay. I followed the instructions. I didn't diamond paint. I diamond painted all the regular drills. And then I did this ironing thing. And then I did hold it. But I don't know what temperature my iron is. Because I only have... All, my iron just has settings for type of fabric. So I was just like, I'm just going to put it at three. So that's the lowest setting before, like, you have to put water in for steam. So, and that's what the normal setting I used to, to iron my canvases. And I did press for 10 to 15 seconds, but when I took it off, when I took the iron off, it was, some of it still pulled off. So then I did another five seconds and then somewhere in there, I melted some drills. So that's my disclaimer. It might not even be that noticeable. And some of the glue also kind of started moving away. So here's my two gloves. I think they turned out really cute. The cats are really, really cute here. I did not seal these, FYI. <laughs> but yeah, see, I 
some of the excess glue melted over there. Um, what I meant when I said when I tried to pull it up, like, like it was mainly the tail. This tail, like, it was not sticking, but you can see the excess plastic there. And which one was the one that I melted the drills? I think it... Okay, I don't know if you could tell. I should get a pen. <laughs> you see this? These drills are flat. Mm, flat drills. They don't have the normal like. Yeah, no, they're they're kind of flat. I need, I need some pointy drills. Okay, so here's the Care Bear here. Um, do you? I don't know if you could tell, but yeah, see that drill is flat. They're normally supposed to be nice and pointy like that. <laughs> Yep, I melted some drills. I melted some drills. Here. And I melted the black here too. They're just flat, flat drills. But hey, it stuck on there. <laughs> and one good thing is it didn't seem like there was excess sticky. So I'm not going I'm not planning to seal these. I did put the special drills after I diamond painted it, um, which is a good thing because these these eyes, I, they would have melted. Um <laughs> But yeah, I melted some drills. But hey, they're probably like really stuck on there now. But I think this these turned out actually really nice. And the gloves actually are pretty nice looking. I don't know how you're going to clean this. So this is a no cleaning at all gloves, I guess. But how often do you clean your gloves? Just let them hang dry, but yeah. Uh, FYI, I have small hands. Um, in, in scientific gloves, medical gloves, I do wear size small, so in case you want to see how it fits, it's not tight or anything. So yeah, there's the cute little cats with my melted drills, and here is my Care Bears. Move you up a little bit here. And here is my owl stickers. There. All right. So thank you very much to DIY Choose for sending these items for review. And thank you for watching and happy diamond painting. Bye.